Practical Farm program for practical farmers. The Yellow River Farm. With Georgia's popular farmer, Channing Cope. Discussing problems, broadcasting information of interest to every Georgia farmer. 6 a.m. Monday through Saturday, join Channing Cope's Kudzu Club, WAGA 590 on your dial. Certainly it is easy here on the Yellow River Farm where we hold forth. At Yellow River we practice front porch farming. We farm from our own front porch and mostly from an easy chair. It is a wonderful thing to own a piece of land and to play with it and to induce it to produce food and clothing and shelter and security and independence. Now it has been rumored around, and you may have heard that rumor, that we are very much interested in the oriental vine called kudzu. We have observed it for years, have visited the farms of the pioneer growers, and have been planting it on our own Yellow River farm for some time. In association with the Soil Conservation Service and this radio station, WAGA, we formed the Kudzu Club of Georgia, which has since grown into the Kudzu Club of America. We have answered thousands of kudzu communications from all over the world. We have presided over two annual meetings of the kudzu clubs and have heard the spontaneous expressions of members as they enumerated the many virtues of this miracle plant. We have learned of its honorable history through the Chinese who have grown it since the time of Confucius. Some people call it foot a night, and it grows about 12 inches a day and night, about 50 feet a year. A lot of people call it porch vine. They would put it on the west side of the house and have strings going up, and it would run up, keep the sun off of the porch and off the house. It came in Philadelphia for an exposition in what, 18? 1896. 1896 or something. We had a World's Fair up there in Japan. Then the Soil Conservation Service saw that, my goodness, we were just, our land was washing away, losing tons of topsoil on every acre. And they started setting it out in the gullies, paying people to set it out, a CCC camp, they'd pay them to set it out, and they set it out here. And then when the bull weevil got to cotton and people quit cotton farming and just left them the kudzu across the fields. <laughs> 